what Children in Crossfire have done. So a very um, special welcome to you to City Hall. Nothing you've achieved would have been possible without the great support. And over the past 25 years, John Lincoln has been one of your supporters and greatest friends. That John has been with Children in Crossfire throughout its first 25 years, I think speaks to the kindness and his consistent goodwill. I'm delighted to announce that in recognition of all those years of service and in anticipation of many years still to come, uh, today John officially becomes Children Crossfire's Ireland Ambassador. We've travelled with a number of African countries together. Every time I've asked John to do anything, he has done it willingly and with enthusiasm. And you know, when celebrities do things for charities, you're more than happy if they just turn up and get the photograph taken and do their act in John's case. And that is more than enough you can ask for, ask for anybody. But with John, it was always much, much more. I realised that I met a person who actually cared about children, who cared about changing the world, and who really wanted to help as often and as much as he could. John, many congratulations. You've richly deserved it. Well, my God, 22 years with Children in Crossfire, and to be made ambassador of Ireland for Children in Crossfire means so much to me. Go to Africa, go to Ethiopia, Gambia, Tanzania, Kenya. Uh, it's all been a huge learning curve for me and a total pleasure to help Children in Crossfire, and especially Richard Moore. John, once again, many, many congratulations. John Lennon, ladies and gentlemen.